Hey friends, it's Shani, Certified Feline Training and Behavior Specialist with Wild at Heart. And how do you play with a blind cat? I think it could be actually more fun for you. Even though cats do rely on their vision, their sense of smell and their hearing are just as important. When you're shopping for your cat who is blind, you want to look for toys that make noise and also maybe have certain types of scents like catnip. Now, don't forget about your cat's sense of touch. Get toys that are tactically exciting for your cat. So a bunch of different materials. A lot of toys have bells on them. Some of the feather toys make specific sounds when you whip them through the air. That tassel toy makes a swishing sound, which really sounds like an animal or their prey in the bushes running away. There's also toys that make squeaking sounds or bird sounds, all exciting things for a cat that has to rely on their sense of hearing. And don't forget about their sense of smell. I use catnip and silverfine all the time. I dip toys in that. It excites them. It just adds another level of enrichment and excitement. Whether your cat was born deaf or they're getting older, losing their hearing, or they have some other disease where they're losing their hearing, your cat still needs to play. They still love to play and they are still fully capable of playing like every other cat does. So if you have a blind cat and you have some excellent toy ideas or activities, please drop them in the comments. I love, love, love hearing your ideas. And I love it when people do DIY projects and activities with their cat to enrich their cat's lives.